Hey there, everyone. This is Aokao playing uh, Banjo 2. I wanted to check something real quick. Okay, so yeah, I'm nowhere close to a new cheat, but I am... I can get the new health, so I'm gonna do that. So hey there, everyone. It's Aokao playing Banjo 2. -y. So quickly we got both moves in this land. Uh, so pretty good. That's done. We will be returning shortly as we've opened up also the 8th world and the 8th world is where... It is the end of the first loop and it is the start of the second loop. Both are the exact same it turns out. Um... Ah oh man, I, I'm gonna be real. I don't know if I like World 8 all that much. It is... it is a thing. You'll see it soon enough, but, uh... Anyway, we gotta go through this scene here, check it out, it's Honeybee. She's got honey on the thing, you see, and when we get all of them, we'll get the last hexagon that's over there in the back. That's how it goes, so you ha yeah, that's right, one extra energy unit. And I'm assuming that with all the rest, we can get one more for the finale. Pop. I appreciate that Banjo has the universal bear ability to just heavily condense groups of things he owned into a single object. Here, for example, just smashing it together and creating a single honeycomb instead of like having to toss all of them at once. You know, it's very expedient. Bears are known to be uh, a very efficient type of animal. I just made that up, actually. Wasteland! Uh, here we go! Silo on! And fly! We're not gonna fly. Not gonna fly yet. Alright, so... Alright, so... There's, there's no holding back. There's no stepping away. This is part of the game. Music got pretty wacky. Get in the bubble! So, it referred something about being Cloud World on the sign, right? I mean, you know, it's also in the name of the level. That's gonna appear real soon. Here we go, that's a map of the world! It's Cloud Cuckoo Land! Uh, it's... the music is very aggressive. I'm just gonna say it. And, uh, yeah! That's what it looks like! Very exciting. What are you doing here? Most important character in the game? Fancy a little physical exercise. <laughs> Man, is the game just not aware that Banjo's like really jacked? If you can beat me in three events, I'll give you my fitness gold medal. Oh boy! As you can probably see, event one is the high jump. Bar set at his best height. Yeah, it makes sense. Sweet. Uh, I probably need to like split up, right? Oh yeah, that's pretty high up. All right. Well, I'll look into that later, buddy. So here we get nothing. Pretty good. There's like this squishy thing. It's pretty fun because you know you do that. There's a garbage bin there. It's pretty great. Yeah, so, and there's a flower you can interact with, by which I mean you get gobbled up and spit out! Uh, and the frame rate dies. <laughs> so, yeah, see over here there's just like more stuff, just like cheese there on a platform. So, there's just platforms there. Cloud Cuckoo Land is the world of, there's just kind of stuff places. It's, I always felt like it was very, look man, we got these assets, now we got a strange looking seed. I'm glad that you can actually keep playing while they're talking there. That was a life, I'm guessing, by the banjo twang. Here we got feathers. Where did I use feathers last? I don't know. Here's, oh! Oh, 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 oh. Well, might as well just go... Oh, this looks very not awkward in the slightest. <laughs> and you just kinda have to go around the world. Hi! I'm allowed to cheat! Yeah, that's right. Uh, like, I blatantly cheated. I had spring shoes on. 
but then they disappeared once the Aveno is over, so he can't really check, check, like, check out for any traces of tomfoolery. Banjo and Kazooie, uh, is in the sack, yeah. morally ambiguous. Uh, yeah, so, yeah, I guess we're started. <laughs> this, this is, this is where we're at. Is... No, that's not what I meant to do! Away I go. Well, you get to see the way out, how that looks like. Magnificent. Oh yeah, and here we can clearly see, due to the camera angle, that it was indeed a honeycomb on my unearthed. Uh, hooray! But here's... They really hit that one really hard. <laughs> like, I feel like the weight of whatever you can unearth here is not, like, evenly... Uh, distributed, it feels like to me. I don't know. There's a cave here, there's a path here. There's, like, mud there. There's a bee flying. Remember bees? It's the bees from the first game, I'm pretty sure. But now they're just floating around and doing bee sounds. Ah, uh, oh, it's a big old heart. Heart of mud. Heart of mud. Uh, you can't go through this mud. That would, it's like a gelatin texture. It's really fun. Um, not sure what I can see down there, because I'm kind of like, I exist on it. One! With like a clockwork kazooie egg. Sweet. Okay. Um. Here we are. So yeah, there was, there's a cannon flower there to blast you somewhere. Let's not, you know, get overwhelmed quite yet. Let's enter the sweet cave. The only cave that exists that's worth looking at. Yeah, you got notes right in your face. Alright, so, uh, here we are, someplace. There's clearly more caves and a guy with a hot dog. Pretty sure these, like, just kinda appear forever. They instantly generate at all times. I wanna go to that middle part that I could see, but I don't know where the middle is anymore. Okay, there we go. Well, there is an egg. Um, here's... so we got spring pat shoes, we got wall shoes, we got split up. I'm assuming I can't just interact with that, right? Can't burn it up a little bit? Well, there's a split up pat right here, so, you know, if you're gonna be hatching, now's as good a time as any, I guess. Yeah, I think that they start with, like, starting health or something? I don't know. There's a... it's... this. There we go. You have to press the button combination to sit down. Hey, check it out! It's a fairy of some kind. Wow! That's rare. Flotus Flotium Creature. I'm not mistaken. Okay. Why do I care? Uh, Flotus Flotium. Sounds like something you want in your backpack? Like, what does that do? Does that make me float? It does! Oh, that's cool. I must have remembered that from my dreams. Uh, I guess that would let me head on over here. I don't know what I'd do with that jello mold. I guess, can I go? I don't think I can go higher. There's a move in there. There's a spring pad that you cannot activate. That's fun. Oh, okay. That sweet move I got, that makes- do you do that? It lets you go into small places. So there you go. I got- I got- I got- I'm gonna get this move. Got some notes here, we got text here. Plant the seed, watch it grow! Of the beanstalk, something it went too fast! Whoosh, that's me, I'm the whooshing man. Alright, hey buddy. Sack pack, when faced by danger, jump on top. Now in the backpack, you can hop. Hold button Z and then tap up. Safely inside is where- Okay, right, it's upsie. So, uh, it was pointed out, and it's true. All of his moves are, like, backpack moves. Banjo doesn't get bear moves, he gets backpack moves. There is no bear. The bear is merely the hitbox for the backpack, sadly. Alright, uh, wait. 
I think, yeah, so if there is a note by this opening, I should keep that note there to remind me I haven't been there. Uh, okay, I could have taken the stairs, in fact, I probably should. Here's a spring shoes that I can use. Okay, and you do get a ramp here. Wait a second, I can probably go to that door there that's higher by gliding. I have the ability to fly. Well, the glide, you do a little bit of that, then you do a little bit of that. And, uh, okay, so there are spring pads here, we're gonna use that to get... Johnny Blueface right here, there you go! You have been collected. This entrance does not have an odor in front of it, so I think it's interesting. Oh, wait, I pro- mm, I don't know. Well, this leads me to... yeah, we're back here. Oh, this is the entrance. Really? Okay, I guess that's why they didn't have a note then. Makes a lot of sense. I guess I, I didn't see it by this angle. Alright, that makes sense to me now. I just like the glide. I wish... I wish you had this way earlier. There's an underwater path. There's a... squonky path path. There's a safe, there's water, whoop, there is, uh, saving my blast, there's bad camera sometimes, uh, everything you could ever want. What does it say? Super stash! Uh, it's like a mustache, but for super people. Wow! Talking safe, uh, correct! It's the super stash a lot. No, it's just super stash. Four digit, and that four digit is not infinite. Four digit is kind of, no, yeah. Whoa, she's quick with math, or she knows safe. <laughs> Probably a jiggy, I don't know, it's just the feeling I got. Wait, so if you had known your thing, you would just have let us go in? Yeah, <laughs> like... Uh... Oh no, and he's aware he's kind of dumb. To be fair, that is what he's programmed to do, you know, if the person has a combination, yeah, open wide. But... Oh, that's silly that he just kind of offers to open himself up, that just seems counterintuitive. Is that the right word? It is now. So here's this place, okay, yeah, so keeping with the schema of having a note in front of each door. Which seems smart, honestly, like, if you want to have a way to keep track of where you've been. Look where you don't have notes on. Oh, Globo. Right here. Underwater. Underwater Globo! It doesn't need air to breathe. Underwater Globo! Here is just all the feathers you'll need! That is a lot of fun. That is too many flatters, honestly. I wish I could glide without, uh, Fancy Free, honestly. You know, just so I could, uh, float everywhere through all these land masses. Hey. Hey, flower. That's right. Hey, eyeball. I'm gonna eyeball you up. I uh, you hate that, huh? You're holding a jiggy. Give me the jiggy. Give me. Alright, I'm gonna blow you up, man. Don't think I won't do it. I'm gonna fire you up. Alright, you don't care. I'm gonna blow you up. And I'm gonna ice you up. Just does not care. Does not listen to me. He has a thing in his thing. Okay, so- Oh! So you do give us a nice fun- Oh, wait. No. You do give me an I- Well, you do give me an ice. George Ice Cube! I want your flight pad to be opened up for me. Uh-huh. All right. I did not meet Mildred. Oh, jeez, that must be scary. Won't you melt? Although it might- it's probably really cold. Okay. You could just give a little push. I can do that. I'll use my bear push powers. There you go. I had to use my bird, though. That is not the voice I was imagining. Oh, that is, um... C 
See, that's just mean-spirited. But that was a key necessary to do. So now that water is less hot. Wow. You just killed George Ice Cube. And it's... It's like, it's not funny. It's... I don't know what it is. It's... It just is. It's just mean. It's just mean-spirited. Oh, wait a second. Yeah, here, here's that thing. Okay, uh, we can... It's been a while since I... Since I... We hatched a clockwork. Here we go, it's me! I'm the clockwork, buddy! I'm gonna blow up this switch, I guess. <laughs> the pressure will, uh, in fact, press a button. Uh, okay. There you go. I remember what a combination is, too. But, uh, yeah, no, yeah, just, yeah, nice little freeze frame on that. That guy just looking completely buzzed. Um... I should just... Whoa! Someone's in the air! Okay. So... Whoa! And you threw an eyeball at me. That's like, okay, weird. <laughs> okay, that's super weird. Alright, I, I need to just get rid of this band-aid. There's a cannon to leave here, and the springy thing to land. I pressed the wrong button and got in a jam. I think inside her tent, since we're here. I'm surprised there's not like a warp pad. Like, normally warp pads are like really close to these, but uh, not here. Alright. It's very mixed on the globos I've spent and those I haven't. I've not been very, um, regular with that. Do I just do, or at least attempt to do, the most frustrating thing in this game, probably? And just rip that band-aid out. Yeah, it's the crazy canary woman. That's her. That's right, well there's a machine next to us. Oh, of course! The Clockwork Mouse! <laughs> yeah... Okay. Well, let's see how this goes. So, this is a game stopper for a lot of people. Like, you have to mash. But the thing is, also, there's rubber banding, so if you mash too much, uh, Canary Mary gets, like, magically super fast, and, um, gets back to you. But my ma- like, this here, I, like, I was legitimately trying to mash, and, like, I was, like, completely, completely destroyed. So, this is just kind of hard, and it's- you have to do it. And it's unpleasant. I can't, I don't know. Like, I'm genuinely trying to mash here, and I'm, like, nowhere close. So... <laughs> so... I don't know how I'm gonna square this. Hop on a mouse to race, press A, you know, and I'm pressing A. I'm gonna have to maybe change where A is on my controller? Maybe. I don't know. I'm gonna have to figure a solution here. Because, like, A on an N64 controller, where it is, and where it is on this controller I'm using, the Xbox controller, 
It's kind of different. So I don't know. I don't know how. Oh yeah, there was only one move. I got all the moves now. By the way, just one. I look. I understand if they kind of ran out, but um, yes. Yeah. I need to figure this out. So uh, hopefully I have some kind. Like or just like just change where A is momentarily. I mean, like I said, I'm gonna. I gotta see what I can do.